and improving the growth rate is now on tourism. In fact, without us doing anything, tourism has doubled and people are finding it difficult to have hotels or places to stay. So we are now inviting tourism uh, uh, investment in tourist resorts. So I, I'm, maybe I'm at least one of the few uh, Norwegians that have visited up in the Swat Valley. Uh, it's beautiful and you also have beautiful other places. Uh, I think Swat Valley used to be the honeymoon place uh, even in uh, Pakistan. Is it no also uh, you see tourism also in these areas where uh, the Pakistani Taliban is used to uh, to run and uh, you're not concerned that uh, uh, Pakistani Taliban can come back and and uh, you're pretty sure that this is on no on, on safe footing. You see in Pakistan now Virtually, there's, there's no terrorism in Pakistan, and I have to pay tribute to our security forces. Uh, they did uh, such a brilliant job, and it was for a while, uh, we went through a really difficult period, but thanks to them, there is hardly any terrorism. I mean, you have the odd problem, but you know, that you have anywhere in the world. Problem now is we need peace in Afghanistan and stability. Whatever, uh, terrorism now comes into Pakistan every now and then is from Afghanistan. And that's why, uh, that's why this peace process in Afghanistan is very important. The, uh, the quicker Afghanistan settles this peace and stability, it's not just only good from, uh, for Pakistan from uh, the terrorism point of view, but also the connectivity to Central, uh, Central Asia uh, and which will benefit uh, both Afghanistan and Pakistan. Are you, uh, Mr. Prime Minister, optimistic that there can be a deal between Taliban um, and the government in Kabul? Um, Americans are very much uh, involved in this. Uh, you're also contributing. Um, is, is it possible this year? And do you think Taliban will also engage in a deal that will respect uh, the rights of girls' education, uh, women, and, and those areas where there have been progress uh, in Afghanistan? Well, the, the first thing is that there, there has to be peace. And that could only happen if uh, Taliban and the Afghan government, they sit together and there's a political settlement. That has to be the first step. Uh, just my view, I, I do not think that, you know, the saying uh, that you only cross the river once what was in 2001 is not going to be now the case if, if and when Taliban and the Afghan government come together because so much has happened since then.